So the current situation with the Olympic Stadium in Stratford, which was obviously host to all those glorious moments during the Games in the summer, is that it, it's awaiting the decision of the London Legacy Development Corporation, which after many tussles and years of debate and conjecture, is now trying to decide between two quite stark options for its future. One is to take up the option of West Ham moving in, fund a full bells and whistles, £190 million conversion of the stadium, which would entail new retractable seats going in, a full new roof that would cover the entire stadium, permanent toilets, permanent executive boxes and so on. The other option, which would have it open much more quickly, uh, probably by spring 2014, would see athletics sharing with pop concerts and very other, various other uses, but would probably require some ongoing public subsidy. And they're the two quite stark options now facing the uh, LLDC board. Boris Johnson has, has very much indicated that he's uh, in favour of this West Ham option. The only fly in the ointment is that he's got to persuade West Ham to cough up more money. West Ham put their best and final bid in, if you like, on Friday. Um, and the question is now whether that's enough for them to put in the pot to fund this conversion of £190 million. If I was a betting man, I'd say that it still will end up going down the West Ham route, but that won't be without its difficulties too, because he's got to sell that decision to a sceptical public who are already wondering why this has taken so long and why it's cost so much public money. I think the worst case scenario would be that this just dragged on and on. Already it's gone, dragged on well beyond the point that it was supposed to. This was all supposed to be decided before the uh, Olympics opening ceremony. We're already nearly in 2013. It looks like the stadium probably won't open until 2016 if they take the uh, full conversion option. So I think that the worst thing, and this could do would be to drag on and on. They need a clear plan and they need to make their case to the public as to what as to what exactly is going to happen so they don't lose the enthusiasm that they generated over the summer.